Charles order secretly investigate Meg Kidd's birth as hospital confirms their fake birth certificate. A video circulating on Facebook claims that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, also known as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, do not have a daughter, Lilibet Diana. The video contains multiple jibes at Markle and calls her children invisible and imaginary, claiming Lilibet does not exist. The 10 minute 30 second video further states that there is no official record of Lilibet's birth, such as a birth certificate. However, the claims are baseless. According to a report by People magazine, Lilibet was born at 11.40 a.m. on June 4, 2021, at the Santa Barbara Cottage Hospital, which is close to Meghan and Harry's Montecito, California home. These details come from Lilibet's birth certificate, which was obtained by the magazine. TMZ also published a redacted birth certificate in June. The certificate has the Duke of Sussex as the first name of one parent, with His Royal Highness given as the last name, whereas Rachel Meghan Markle is given as the second parent's name. Meghan and Harry have attempted not to reveal their children's faces to the paparazzi for as long as possible for privacy reasons. In 2020, the couple sued a celebrity news agency and filed an invasion of privacy lawsuit for taking unauthorized photographs of their son Archie while he was playing with his maternal grandmother in their backyard, the New York Times reported. According to several media reports, Queen Elizabeth met Lilibet for the first time during the Jubilee celebrations in the UK in June 2022. In other news, King Charles will offer further olive branch to his estranged son Prince Harry in hope of healing the royal rift with titles for his and Meghan Markle's children, Archie and Lilibet. Following the death of Queen Elizabeth II, Harry and Meghan's children have become His Royal Highness Prince Archie of Sussex and Her Royal Highness Princess Lilibet of Sussex. The change is a result of conventions created over a century ago. Under rules set out by George V in 1917, the grandchildren of the monarch automatically receive royal titles. As grandchildren of King Charles III, Archie and Lilibet now have the right to be prince and princess. However, month after the Queen's death, the couple's children are still listed on the royal family's official website as Master Archie Mountbatten-Windsor and Miss Lilibet Mountbatten-Windsor. Roy Nikar, the Times royal editor, previously alleged that the indecision is heightening tensions between Charles, his youngest son Harry, and his wife Meghan. Royal author Katie Nichol claimed the public is set to hear imminently if the children have received HRH titles. Now, it's revealed that Charles has decided on their grandchildren's royal titles. And the new king wants to give another chance to Harry and Meghan by extending Olive Branch. It means Archie and Lilibet may get the titles soon. I think Charles has been devastated by how things have spiraled. He made the concession to allow Harry to wear his uniform when he was standing vigil by the Queen's coffin and of course, there's the matter of titles, whether, his grandchildren, Archie and Lilibet will get, them, Ms Nickel claimed during talks with Fox News. She added, will that be the final olive branch that is offered? I think we'll hear about that imminently. But,